Advances in technology are really amazing, and especially when it comes to those medical advances. It's the focus of a new exhibit at the Orlando Science Center, and you still have a chance to take the kids to check it out. So News 6 Insider Guide, Chris Moyer, is here now to tell us all about Bionic Me. Yes, ladies, you have about a week left to visit that exhibit at the Orlando Science Center. It has so many interactive elements that educate adults and kids, inspiring the future innovators of technology that helps improve mobility. Pretty much deal with, uh, with the hip joints over here, as well as the knee joints. And from a muscular standpoint, you can see how many muscles interplay uh, around the knee joints. Dr. Jeff Petrie is an orthopedic surgeon with Advent Health and says he sees patients ranging from teenage to seniors. Playing pickleball, tennis, golfing, uh, running. Um, and so what I tend to see is issues with the knees and the hips and patients coming in and either um, they may have some arthritis. I think that it's important to do some stretching and strengthening to have longevity with playing those types of sports as well. While Dr. Petrie performs surgeries like hip replacements to improve mobility and reduce pain, there is some tech helping others get around like exoskeletons and prosthetics. Technology highlighted in the Bionic Me exhibit at the Orlando Science Center. This is a marriage of science and technology to make the human experience better, to, to make people more active, um, to decrease pain. We often do work with companies um, and, and have a lot of relationships with the companies, but a lot of us actually, we innovate as well. Interactive exhibits demonstrate the design and biomechanics behind prosthetics. Step into an exoskeleton consisting of motors and metal frames that mimic bones and joints. The technology increases movement, strength and endurance. You can also race against a Paralympian and learn about sports prosthetics, technology creating innovative solutions to bone loss and paralysis. Exhibits, Dr. Petrie says, may inspire kids. Mathematics, science, the things that we're teaching our kids through, uh, through grade school, middle school and high school, I think that that leads to the next generation of people who are innovating this kind of technology. The Bionic Me exhibit runs through September 5th. I posted information on clickorlando.com slash insider, as well as some opportunities to get free admission to the Orlando Science Center. Ladies. We, we love the Science Center. Yeah. You got to check out the exhibit, yeah, right? Yeah, the Bionic Me. That was, it was very cool. Um, I have to admit that the kids love just racing and trying that to That is like yes. the most I mean, popular part it of is. the exhibit. <laughs> there's also, it's a cool one where there's... Um, kind of like a wind tunnel that you actually like strap on like wings yep. and learn how oh you know goodness. wind moves through different things so I mean it's, it's the, I mean they always are just so creative yes. and these exhibits that can are just continue to to interest so many people and we love how it changes all the time mm -hmm. so if you have membership mm -hmm. it's always like you're going to a new science center exactly. did you put the wings on um I did I don't have <laughs> what, what, what was that experience I, I, I need a bird. Bird. Like a bird did you take flight <laughs> I did almost almost <laughs> But anyway, I mean, but it, that's the great thing about it is you can, you know, even if you're an adult, you can still enjoy it. It's not just, you know, a, a, a well, kid's you know, they have those adult, they have the adult nights at the science yes. center a yeah. few times a year, too. So that's yeah. nice. So, so, you know, something for all the ages. Yes, 